Hello, friends. It's Andrew here at Unlimited Singing Bowls with another beautiful set of seven crystal bowls. This is what they call a medium-sized set from Crystal Tones. And again, all these bowls, this is American quartz. It hasn't been used for um, any other purposes besides these bowls. Um, what I'm calling this particular set is um, basically holding safe space. This set of bowls that we're going to call it the holding safe space set. And I'm going to explain that to you now, what it is. We're looking at seven bowls. And what's interesting, if you look at this, if you use your eyes before you use your ears, we're noticing the lower three chakras, first, second, third in your body, much bigger bowls. They're going to be louder when we play them. They're going to be deeper. Here's your heart chakra, the what basically the uh the space between the body chakras and the upper chakras, in, um, which is your fifth, sixth, and seventh, which have more spiritual connections, but they're all spiritual. Your chakras are a spiritual part of your yourself, um, but they're much stronger. Why are they much bigger and stronger? Because they're going to help create a safe space for the people that you're doing sound healing work with. Um, I think this set is going to be really, really great for someone who might be a massage therapist who's working there. Maybe you're a psychologist or a psychotherapist who's working, trying to create a space for maybe some of your clients or have some trauma. Like if you're working with people that are coming out of traumatic situations, be it family related or refugees, even um, it's going to be really great for some, maybe who goes in and works with anybody who has PTSD. And why is that? Because these three bowls, the lower chakras are going to get people centered and into the body and into the brain, the mind, where maybe they have some trauma that you're working with them to help release. The four chakras is going to make it safe. And here, the spiritual ones are going to connect but and bring it in. But usually by the time you're getting into a space where you're working on some therapeutic situation for yourself, you as a spirit, the client as a spirit, has already sort of put themselves there or their spirit guides or their guides have put them in that position to work with you. And so now because they're already there. What's important is you helping them create the space, space, whatever you're doing with guided meditation, with therapy, um, whatever it's Reiki, whatever you're using, these are there to balance it, to create the safe space, to hold the safe space for your client, your the person you're working with, even yourself to release. So we'll just take a just a general walkthrough in this, in this video. In the next video, we'll play it for you to hear it. Here we go for, here's the C. solid sound. Here's your D for the second chakra. Second chakra repository of a lot of emotional energy, usually not even the person. Sometimes other people's energy are in your, a lot of times other people's second energy is in your second chakra. Like that guy or girl that liked you at the bar, they threw a lot of energy in your second chakra and said, Hey, baby, that's where that second chakra is holding a lot of that. Third chakra, solar plexus, a lot of power there. Third chakra is how you create in the world. You ever been in a room where someone walks in and kind of bowls you over sometimes? That might have a big ass third chakra that's pushing things through. Four chakra or heart. I think there was a line in a B-52 song that, that doesn't that make you feel a whole lot better? Uh-huh. That's what that chakra probably did to you. Fifth. I can see clearly now. Well, the rain is gone. Well, here in Nebraska this winter, we haven't had much rain yet. Um, and the crown chakra.
Now, if you've been listening to the bowls and not my verbiage, you'll notice, whoa, those were so much higher and they're so much smaller than these. Because here, the body and the emotions, the energy needs to be safe and supported, brought into line with all this stuff that's already there. So I'm just going to play it real briefly at the end of this. set of bowls is like your best friend that's there when you want to unload. It's like your mom, if you had a nice mom that liked to make cookies and hold you when you were sad. It's there to help let the trauma go. So that's the introduction. We're going to do a separate video where we just play it and let healing happen. And I thank you for taking the time to listen to me. Thanks.